Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we are going to talk about why the tire pressure light won't turn off. Here is what causes it and how to fix the issue. The tire pressure is low. The purpose of the pressure lights is to inform the user that the tire pressure is low. Therefore, this is the most common reason why the pressure light won't go off. Some car infotainment systems will always tell you which tire needs to be fixed. If your car lacks this feature, move around the tires with the tire pressure gauge to measure the amount of pressure the tires have against the manufacturer's recommendations. If you find one tire pressure below the manufacturer's recommendations, refill it accordingly. It should solve the pressure light problem that won't turn off. Drained sensor batteries or damaged sensors. The tire pressure monitoring system sensor batteries are designed to last 7 to 10 years. Some can be drained earlier and others later than the general period. Also, like other electronics, the sensors go through depreciation, overextended use. The sensors can also get damaged due to potholes, curb strikes, or during the car service procedure. Here are the steps to follow to deal with the sensor issue. With the help of a qualified mechanic, access the sensors in the tire pressure monitoring system. Check if the sensor's battery is drained or if the sensors are damaged. Replace the sensors if you notice one or all of the mentioned issues. Remember, the sensor batteries are sealed within the sensors, so you can't replace them individually. Slow leaks. Your car tires might slowly leak air, causing the pressure light to be repeatedly triggered even after refilling. The slow leaks can be a result of damaged air valves, wheels, or punctures, which allow air to escape slowly. Do a quick inspection with the help of a qualified professional and rectify any of the issues mentioned if present. You might need to replace the wheel or the valve if they are damaged. Thanks for watching.